Welcome to Nutriment Project. Here, we are glad to introduce the Amora technology and products developed by the Dutch company Carlson. The main objective of this technology is to solve the ammonium problem in manure and manure-derived waste streams, in manure processing flows such as slurry or digestate produced by a digester, high quantity of occurs in the form of ammonium, which shows high risk of ammonia emission during storage and disposal. In these cases, nitrogen recovery is more efficient and cheaper than nitrogen remover. Therefore, Amorphra technology is developed to recover the ammonium from manure and digestate. The products from it can be used as fertilizers in agriculture. Nitrogen recovery with Amorpha is incredibly interesting for waste and wastewater flows with high levels of ammonia. With a well-designed stripper, Amorpha can process highly polluted flows and the technology can be applied directly to manure or digestate without any pretreatment. Amorpha technology is a continuous process and consists of two consecutive process steps. Carbon dioxide and ammonia are successively removed from the substrate in the stripping section. The stripping air is passed through a gas stripper, while the ammonia is captured in a liquid fertilizer. Both ammonia sulfate and ammonia nitrate can be produced. There are seven Several advantages of Amorpha technology. The stripping tank features a preparatory aeration field and distribution system, allowing it to process thick flows with high quantity of dry matter, such as slow manure and digestate or heavily polluted waste water. Amorpha technology can be applied at farm scale for the optimal circular farming concept or fit into large-scale manure treatment facilities with a flexible capacity from 1 to 500 tons per hour. This is an energy-efficient way to process large quantity of nitrogen and it's an easier discharge of residue flows in manure processing and biogas systems. It can also increase the capacity of feeding high nitrogen substrate to digesters and the energy consumption is lower, lower compared to nitrogen taxation and it can also achieve pasteurization in the same system. Here is an example of a Mofra parrot installed in the Netherlands. It was installed in 2020 in Alter uh, Axel and it serves for a biogas plant to recover nitrogen fertilizer from digestate. Here is the 3D model of this parrot. Depending on the acid added into the process, it can produce ammonia sulfate or ammonia nitrate. The produced nitrogen fertilizer can have a nitrogen content of 7% in ammonia sulfate or 18% in ammonia nitrate. These recovered products are expected to be listed as mineral fertilizer from 2020 for the whole EU. On far labor, this reduced the fertilizer purchase to a minimum. Depending on local situation, these fertilizers can be applied in any farm systems like conventional or organic, etc. with nitrogen demanding crops or nitrogen and sulfur demanding crops. Application of this fertilizer is identical to liquid nitrogen fertilizers by using a sprayer bar. The recommended application doses are crop and soil demanding, maximum 250 kg nitrogen per hectare. These products are currently prior to market introduction. The price is about 100 euro per ton. If you are interested in the, this technology and products, please visit the Nutriman Farmer platform to find out more details. 
a Nutriman website is displayed in eight EU languages. You can also get in touch with the vendors through the contacts produced in the info sheet. All this information will be open for the public by 2031 and Nutriman project will keep updating with more inputs when available. Welcome to share your opinion by filling in surveys on the website.